If you're looking for some great and free reverb plugins, stay tuned because we created a short but good list of different style free reverbs to choose from. Reverb is one of the most used effects in music, so you'd better have some of these great effects in your DAW. We made a short list of interesting but different reverb effects that are free. And also have a specific sound like a plate or research reverb or a reverb that runs on convolution. Let's start with a plate reverb simulation. The TAL Reverb 4 is the latest release of this great plate reverb. You can simply download the zip file and in this zip you will find several install files. Just choose the one that is suited for your system and start the installation. It will ask you the folder where to put the plugin and finish installing. It has 10 presets but you can create your own and save them in a list. The controls are quite easy to work with and they do exactly what they should. Let's listen to some drum sounds running through it. The Foxengo Old School Verb is what it says it is, an old school reverb, which offers some great reverbs from decades ago. It can be downloaded from the Foxengo website as an installation file. All you have to do is start the installation, select which version you want to install and in what folder the plugin should be. The reverb has 18 presets which can be changed and saved again. The layout of the controls is quite easy to follow and if you have made changes you want to undo, there's a small undo and redo button. There is also an AB switch, you can load two different reverbs and switch between them. This is handy if you want to make a decision between two reverbs and want to listen to both. Also the dry mute button is handy when you use this reverb on an effects channel. Let's listen to some of the reverbs. The mu verb is also a reverb to consider. It comes as a zip file and can be downloaded from the website. If you open the zip, you will see a folder. All you have to do is drag this folder to the folder on your computer where you have your plugins. If you start the mu verb in your DAW, you will be asked to agree to the user license and then you can start using it. It has nine presets to get you started a very interesting filter system for the reverb and a separate pre-delay for left and right, so you can make some interesting and strange reverbs with it. And this is how it sounds. The Yuhi Protoverb is an experimental research project. It downloads as an installer in a zip file. So after unpacking you have to start the installer where you have to choose which plugin version you want to install and in which folder. There are 15 presets but you can also change these and the special thing about this project is that you can use the two randomized buttons at the bottom called model and delays to create a totally new sound. 
It is researchware, so they use it for data mining and hope people will share these settings. It is best to check out the Yuhi website about this and here is how it sounds. Finally, we will have a listen to a convolution reverb, which is something completely different. These reverb systems are using pre-recorded samples of the reverb impulse of a real existing space. So you can have the reverb of the Royal Albert Hall, or of a famous church or any other building. For this we use the free Convology XY plugin of Impulse Record. Downloading it is a bit of a hassle. We had to use an online shopping basket to download the plugin from their website, so we had to fill in our personal information. After this is done, you will see a download page and you will receive an email with links to the Windows and Mac download and the registration ID of the plugin. When you use the effect for the first time in your DAW, it will ask to register the serial number with your name and email address, so there's a lot to do before you can use this convolution reverb, but it's really worth it. It has 70 presets with really great sounding effects, and you can even use your own extra downloaded ER files. We've put some links on the website where you can find extra high resolution WAV files to use in this plugin. Now let's listen to some of them, and in the meantime, subscribe to our channel to keep you updated. Thank <laughs> you.